going on guys? I know I look good. I look real good. This is the DJI Osmo Action. And if you don't know who DJI is, uh, just look up at all the drones. That's DJI. They came out with this camera. It was about, it might be a year ago or coming up on a year. Anyway, this is their competition for the GoPro. And the reason I like it is because if I'm using it, not as a head cam, if I'm using it on a tripod, it's got a front screen. See how I can see what's in frame if I was using it as a tripod. So it's pretty good. The video where Case is uh, basically narrating the entire thing, that was all shot on this camera. Um, and it's waterproof um, and it's only, it's about a hundred bucks less than the new GoPro Hero 8. That was for anybody else making YouTube videos. So I have no idea if I'm in frame or not. So. You're welcome. Probably staring at my gut. Today I've got something for Mr. Haas that I hope he likes. He's got a pretty big uh, pasture area right now, but he's using, from Premier, he's using what's called a uh, sheep and goat fence. My idea with the sheep and goat fence is to put it at the mouth of the gate. And with these Premier One fences, you know, you can shift them and move them around. So anyway, I need, I need my fence back from off. I am a loyal customer. I actually reached out to them for another product and they uh, responded and helped me out a little bit. And when that product gets here, I'll uh, let you guys know. First off, Haas is obviously, as you've seen, he's trained to the green fence. This one's not green, but it will be hot. So he'll know, 208066. It's the uh, hog and piglet fence. Uh, it's only 24 inches high four inches at the bottom and then a section of twos all the way up and then a couple of fours and obviously 24 will suit him just fine um, this one's got plastic reinforcements uh, I think they're like every 12 inches something like that it is the uh, spin around here all this will be in the description below or I will leave a direct link probably both but this is the single spike. And I kind of went over this in my other Premiere video that I'll tag about it out here, especially at the farm is, it's all rocks. And when you get the double spike, um, it works, but it's a lot harder in a really rocky area. And I mean rocky, guys. It's a lot harder in a really rocky area to get two spikes that are not gonna bend or move. Uh, and, and you don't want them to. But it's, it's kind of a hard time finding a spot where they'll both go in and be even and, you know, not sag or whatever over time. That's why I like the single spike, especially with Haas, because I'm going to be moving him around a lot more. Uh, for the goats, I won't move it as much. They're not going to graze like Haas does. They've got hay, they've got feed. Um, they're just not. When you're around. But my intention, you can see what I'm up against. Okay. Mom and dad's house. Farm mailbox a couple of videos ago all this out with the piggies okay and yeah i said piggies right now we've got one i've got a berkshire let me know um i've got a berkshire in line for me i could get this weekend i'm not sure if i'm going to do it or not and the pig just got weaned so she's not very big but i think he can stand tall enough maybe once or twice to get a few pigs out of it i don't know guys i'm new to this so if you know anything about pigs it is berkshire meat you know, but is Berkshire really, really good? Or is it because it's really, really popular pig? Let me know in the comments below what you think. Let's take a walk. What I'm gonna do is pull his house and kind of get him sectioned off over here. And that pig fence is smaller than the goat fence. So I'm going to put it inside it. So that way he's, you know, a little more contained, but I don't know what'll be in frame, but I'm going to run my camera up here. So
she's hot. You moved your bed around, I got you some new straw. I know it feels like you're a little more confined, but I'm gonna be able to move you more often, like effective immediately. So, should be all right, buddy. Okie doke. Sounds good. All right, you can let me pet you for the folks. All righty, that's all I got for you guys today. I've tried to film this like eight times and he keeps turning around with his hind quarters towards the camera. So I'll try again, but that's all I got. Let me know what you guys think about that AGH, the American Guinea Hog and the uh, Berkshire Cross. And let me know if you have experience with it. I appreciate, you know, your thoughts and opinions. I appreciate that you may know somebody who's done it. still just kind of an opinion or this is what I thought happened. So let me know what you guys think. But other than that, Y'all be good, and if you can't be good, be quick. See you later. Need a bath, homie. Nope, not ready yet. <laughs> See y'all later. I'm just kidding. Just kidding. It's for, it's for the tube. It's for the tube. It's all right.